Hey, welcome back to Adventures with Dan. Today's video is going to be going after micros and a special cache at a church that's coming up next. All right, we arrived at our first location of the night. It makes reference to this bridge, so I'm going to focus my attention over here, so. Let's see if we could locate this thing. One of the first rules of caching, check the cache page. That's uh, going to be a big DNF, that one's missing, so on to the next. Alright, our next cache location brings us to these set of pine trees. Maybe we'll have better luck at this cache than we did the last one. So. There's a lot of sap on this tree. Oh, right up in there. All right, Julian, is trying to get it down. I think it's zip tied to the tree, so I'm gonna try to pop it open and sign the log and on to the next. Already, we're at our next location that brings us in between these two pine trees, and I just happened to glance and I noticed it right away. Surprisingly enough, I just have to find my way to the cache. Right there. All right, I'm gonna open that one up, sign it, and on to the next. All right, we're at our next cash location here. Brings us behind this building. We'll be looking for a nano, so let's see if we could locate this. It could be anywhere in here, so. All right, let's see if we can locate it. This cash is here, but we don't have that much time, so I'm gonna pass it and on to the next. Juliana's gonna try to find this one. This one, sign it, and also log this Munzee here. So, all right, I have arrived at where I wanted to arrive. This place is amazing, truly, truly amazing. Hi, guys. Joanna is with me. This is beautiful. This is absolutely why I love geocaching. When you can come to places like this that you never ever knew existed. I grew up in South Buffalo and just never knew this existed, just north of Buffalo. This thing is amazing. This is another view of the cobblestone uh, outdoor mass, kind of like mass hall. This is truly amazing. Hi, this has been Adventures with Dan. I hope you enjoyed my video today. At that last cache, we had to sadly DNF it. It was in an area that we couldn't get to through the stairs being closed. So, But that's one of the reasons why I love caching so much, to bring you to places sort of like that. So if you haven't watched my videos before, please subscribe. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you out there.